Um, focus on nature and also the birds and the bees, I will explain. Uh, we had at the top uh, an exclusive first TV interview with Alan Dershowitz. He had uh, defended Jeffrey Epstein in that 2008 uh, controversial plea deal. Uh, Dershowitz in the interview defends himself um, and also responds to the accusation from one of Epstein's victims. A little twisty, but you're going to want to hear this interview. Then we had Brad Edwards on. Brad Edwards represents more than a dozen alleged victims of Epstein's. And he had two notable things to say. One, more than 50 victims so far have come forward by his count. More than 50, that's a big number. Uh, also, asked him if any other high profile names would come out. You know, Trump has been, President Trump has been in Epstein's orbit. President Bill Clinton has been in Epstein's orbit. And Edward said, I know this case more than anybody. I've been involved for 11 years. And guess what? No other high profile names. That's a big takeaway. Then we, and this is like the, uh, the nature part. That was the birds and the bees. And there's even more birds and the bees to come. Uh, the, the nature part, algae bloom in Mississippi. Every beach in the whole state of Mississippi currently shut down because of fertilizer runoff and heavy rains uh, uh, along the Mississippi River. That's crazy. Think about that. We've done enough damage with chemicals in the water that every beach in the state of Mississippi is unusable. The beach is fine, but the ocean, you can't go in because the water has so much toxic algae in it. Um, and then my favorite uh, segment of the day, Lisa Tadeo, uh, author of Three Women. We teased it yesterday. She came on set and she delivered. I'll leave it up to you, though, to draw your own conclusion. Bye. Bye. Let me get some coffee.